<laughs> hey everyone, it's Christina Creep and Sarah Stein, and today we're going to share a little bit of our t-shirt obsession with some recent purchases <laughs> <laughs> that we have made since December? Yeah, December. Um, from a t-shirt company called Fright Rags. Oh, uh, I don't, I don't even know where to begin. They have some of the best designs I've ever seen. It's true. The art's amazing, and it's all, like, one of a kind. You can only get it there. It's good. <laughs> it's very good. Um, and the one thing about them is they don't keep the same shirts all the time, so there's yeah. always something new. And unfortunately, once they're gone, sometimes they're gone. For good. And they always have really fun specials like Midnight Madness shirts that only sell for 24 hours and at a like discounted price or like mystery tees. Those are really fun. <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> They're like nine bucks a pop. You don't know what you're going to get, but it's from them. So it's going to be good. Always. All right. So what do you I guess we're going to dive right in. <laughs> so they had a really fantastic sale. So we're, I think most of these are from the big sale they had. Yeah. Okay. So, Hey, we're, we're in the same. <gasps> Dun, dun, dun. <laughs> I got the baseball tea version of it. And I have the basic tea. And it's Return of the Living Dead, one of my absolute favorite zombie flicks ever. <laughs> I was so excited for this. I had been um, kind of wanting this for a while. Yeah, me too. I kept getting, um, they always send you stickers and trading cards with every order. And I kept Mega getting this. Warheads. Oh, <laughs> and what? <laughs> and Mega Warheads. warheads. <laughs> so and good. <laughs> I kept getting the sticker for this, and I've been. Mm, I just wanted the t-shirt very badly, so I was very excited. Yeah, the sale it. was a perfect opportunity to indulge. Okay, mm -hmm. I'll grab my next one. I have a couple from this line. They came out with, she has the best thing though. <laughs> <laughs> a trick or treat. Da. Okay, let me see. Yeah, this, this is my favorite one actually from the line, and I got in this one first, and I love it. I love it. I also got this, but I got it on a hoodie. Yeah. And one thing that I really like about their hoodies is that they are zip-up hoodies, and they also put the print on the back so that the zipper doesn't F up the design. Yeah. I really wanted the hoodie, too. I was, she walked in today, and she had it on, and I was like, mmm, but I have the shirt. Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's how obsessive we get over these <laughs> shirts and things. Uh, go on. And we both have that one, too. Yeah. Oh, that's true. Well, go ahead and show yours. We both have this one, but we're not going to bore you by showing the same shirt. This one, Sam and his little... Um, lollipops crisscross. Do like a up and Ooh. down in case up they don't down. see the, the bottom. I love this. <laughs> like, even though the other one's my favorite, I was drawn to this one right away. I just really love the design. And I wear a lot of like high-waisted skirts and shorts and pants and stuff, like really retro style. And I love designs like that that are big because they work really well with that. You can totally pull them off with a skirt. <laughs> That's very good. All right, who's next? Well, I have one more trick-or-treat shirt. Okay, yeah, me too. Oh, you do? Yeah. No. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Love this movie. Again, this was like... Oh, God, this is one of my all-time favorite movies, for sure, because I love Halloween-based horror, like anything that revolves around Halloween and the holiday. Like, those are my favorites, so... Yeah, and I think it had, it had been so long since there was an anthology Halloween movie or even horror movie that had come out. Yeah. It was really good. It's... We need more of those. Yes, we all are doing a trick or treat too. I know, I know. <laughs> <laughs> We're excited about that. Very excited. So one of the things that they did was they had a set for trick or treat, and it was a T-shirt with a mask. They only had a thousand of them. <laughs> only. <laughs> <laughs> but they friggin' sold through them. Like I didn't get it because they ran out of size small so fast, and like by the time I wanted it, like it went on sale. Yeah. Out of luck. So this is what the shirt looks like. <laughs> I don't know. I'm getting it's it in off. frame. I hope yeah, you so. Gotta, I, I always pick it up just in case. Like. <laughs> it was really cool. Um, I love that shirt. It's wonderful. I love it. This little kid. He's so cute. And, and it also came with a limited edition Sam mask. I am so jealous of that. <laughs> <laughs> Hold so on. Jealous. I'll open it so you can yes. see it. And it came with a sticker too, which I did not know it was coming with. Oh no, assist me. <laughs> There we go. It's one of those like old school like plasticky like Halloween masks. I love these. I actually have a lot of the like retro old vintage Halloween masks hanging in my kitchen. It's very <laughs> cool. And then this is the little sticker yeah. oh, that, that so came cute. in the box. It's a little 
glittery holograph Sam trick or treat sticker. I never want to use those stickers that I get. Like I don't, I, try. I don't know what to do with them because I don't want to use them. So I have like piles and boxes of like just stickers. I put a lot of things mm -hmm. on my fridge because I'm a, an adult. <laughs> <laughs> okay, well here's my next trick or treat shirt. And this one was a no brainer for me because all the jack-o'-lanterns, oh, I love it. It's a good one. It is really, they're all good. Never blow out the candle. Never. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I do that now, actually. And not that I think something bad's going to happen or Sam's going to come get me on Halloween, but... I always leave them on. <laughs> I don't know. It's okay. It's almost like honoring the movie. <laughs> you want to sure. go next? Sure. We have a lot of shirts. <laughs> so She has more than me, though. <clears throat> I'm running out. <laughs> I'm out of control. So I got a baseball tee. They had a whole bunch of Halloween 3 t-shirts. one, too, and they were out of massage. <laughs> and here's this one. I always feel like so rad. this is one of the Halloween movies that doesn't get a lot of attention just because you don't see Michael Myers, except he's on the TV in the bar. Yeah. But, you know, it's one of my favorites, the season of The Witch, mm -hmm. although I feel like a lot of people just recognize the imagery right off the bat of the masks. Yes. But I love that movie. It was wonderful. I think a lot of people do. I mean, I guess it's a divided crowd, but it's good. It's good. It's good. <laughs> All right. So when these came out, I had gotten... One for my husband and myself, because we're big fans of this, and he actually still has it on Laserdisc from when he was a kid. <laughs> That's, we're nerds. What can I say? But I, when it went on sale, I had to get the other one. I love it. Garfield's Halloween special. That's just like Halloween childhood right there. Yeah, it is. <laughs> I might wonderful. still watch it a lot. Oh, that's good. Your turn. So I got another Halloween three season of the wood shirt <clears throat> and this one just caught my eye because I've never seen a t-shirt like this where it shows a TV screen but it shows it blurry on purpose mm -hmm. I don't know it was one of those yeah. things where I wasn't initially gonna get it um, but I kept going back to it and I was like just get it yeah. <laughs> when am I ever gonna see this again so I know I feel that way about so many of their shirts though yes. like thank Jeebus for their sales <laughs> when I can finally <laughs> indulge in all the shirts and I'm like finally I mean, I buy their shirts, we both do, all the time anyway, but, like, hauls like this generally happen when there's a good sale because you can just get everything you want. Well, it's true. <laughs> as long as your size is still there, that's always a problem because they sell out of their stuff really, I mean, I feel, not, maybe not quickly, but they do. They do. Right? Um, there was one hoodie that I wanted to get really badly, and I looked in it, they only had it in 4X and extra small, and I was like, that ain't flying. Oh, well. Mm. All right. And maybe next time. My, this is one of the shirts I wanted, but I held off on, obviously, and then I was really happy to get. Bub! <laughs> I love it. And this movie came out on our birth year. Oh, so, 80. 85. So, I don't know. It's one of my favorites, so. Very nice. Your turn. Oh. You might as well do two, because I'm down to... <clears throat> okay, well, I have two, two Chucky and Tiffany shirts. This being the first one. Um... <laughs> Ugh, I remember being a kid and just absolutely loving, like, Chucky. Yeah. I don't know. Child's oh, Play yeah. was always such a cool movie. And it's become a thing with myself and my husband. You ever see those online quizzes where it's like, what serial killer in a movie are you? They're so silly. Well, I took one, and I made my husband take it, too, and he got Chucky. And he was like, who did you get? And I said, Tiffany. And he Aww. goes, who the hell is Tiffany? Oh, I was like, no. I was like, Bride of Chucky? He goes, oh. And when we looked at it, it said, <laughs> it said, um, you like killing, but you're in it for the laughs, and he goes, babe, we are in it for the laughs. <laughs> Her husband would say that. Match made in hell. <laughs> and here's the other one. Last Valentine's Day, I got us Chucky and Tiffany shirts, too. Uh, I got those shirts, too, but I got them during the Black <clears throat> Friday sale, which is not included in the, God, if we included our Black Friday sale shirts, you guys would be with us here forever. All right, do another one, because... Oh, okay, okay. Um, then I'll do one and we get down to that one. Okay, okay, okay. So, I was so excited for this. <laughs> when have you ever seen a shirt for the movie The Burbs? When I was a little kid, this movie was one that I watched so much that the VHS box started peeling. I was gonna say <laughs> oh, I got all excited. I was gonna say this about Bride of Chucky. I wore that VHS out as a kid. Like, I mean, I wasn't a kid. I was a teenager, my God. But yeah, because it was 98, correct? I think so. 98, yeah. I, like, I wore that VHS out. I loved it so much. I don't know what it was about it. And then I did a convention, uh, Saturday Nightmares, years and years ago. I was selling stuff there. I was a vendor. 
and it was like right near Hackensack, New Jersey, and I flipped out, and one of my best friends, Eric, and then my brother Eric had come with me, and I'm like, we gotta find the Hackensack Cemetery. And they're oh. like, you know, it's not the same one. I don't care. <laughs> like, so we did. We had to find it. I was like, it's just, nice. it's a thing to do. It is. <laughs> Very good. All right. <laughs> so here is my other one from Zombie. And I actually got this shirt for my brother for uh, Christmas. And I was really happy to be able to get one for myself. It's the eyeball <laughs> and it's sentimental to me because my brother and I you know when we were kids growing up like we were obsessed with Fulci and we would watch this movie and pause it you know on VHS like all the time like right there like look how gross that is so I feel like this is something him and I kind of I don't know sentiment sentimental Aww. for us you know and we both have the shirt now so I'm pretty excited <laughs> about that very cool and on to the last <laughs> or is it no <laughs> another one so this one <laughs> this one I got in December um, but I didn't buy this this was given to me so I got a garbage pail kids Reagan from the Exorcist Wretched Reagan I love it they had a good bit of um I think they had at least three garbage yeah pail they kids did shirts. there was like a Pennywise one I think I forget what the other one was. I don't remember but I saw oh, them son of a bitch mm. and I mean I don't mind colored shirts I just they were all different colors I just tend not to go yeah. for I wear I do wear a lot of color, but when it comes to t-shirts, I just like basic black. Basic. All right, so it's basic black. <laughs> <laughs> so here's our last one, which we both got. And this, okay, this is what we were talking about earlier, the Midnight Madness sales they do when they go on sale at midnight and then they last for 24 hours and the shirt is gone forever. Ever. There's actually an amazing Sanderson sister one that we probably should have shown too, oh. but that would just be a huge tease because y'all can't get it. <laughs> but, so um... <laughs> this was the last one. Here, can you show yours closer? From Night Run Elm Street, Freddy's Dead. Oh, mm. this is... Fun fact, I think this was New Line's very first 3D movie. Really? Which is really, yeah, which is really great because he has the 3D glasses on. That's true. So it's like homage to that too, and I think you have to be a freaking super nerd like us to know that. <laughs> cool. So we both got that one, and <clears throat> that concludes our haul. Now not to sound like too much more of a tease, there is a chance that if any of these except for the Midnight Madness shirt is not available right now, they do do something, is it called the, the graveyard? graveyard? Yeah, and you can go and you can vote on on their site, we'll put the links down below in the description box. Um, you can go and vote which ones you would like to see come back because they've had that happen quite a few times where yes. a lot of shirts will just keep coming back, but enough people have to vote for it. Yep, and right now they actually have nine that are released, um, I think until the weekend, maybe? Yeah, they do that fairly often. Mm. There's some good ones. There's a Jack Torrance shirt right now. <laughs> I, know, I was eyeballing them, but like, <clears throat> I know. have to be good. Right. Look at everything spot. For now. <laughs> yeah, for now. <laughs> but you should definitely check Fright Rags out. They're amazing. They have everything from more mainstream horror to somewhat obscure horror movies. Like, you can find everything there, and these are definitely one-of-a-kind pieces. Absolutely. So, this is it for our Fright Rags. Well, it's not really a haul. Is it a haul? What's it's, a haul? What's mm. a haul? What's a haul, anyway? What's a haul? I'm what's not defining haul? this. <sighs> Anyways, there are a whole bunch of other companies that we... Yes. Indulgence. <laughs> 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 Wonderful. <laughs> <laughs> I don't even know what that means, but I'm saying it. <laughs> Um, there are a ton of other t-shirt companies that we do order from, but we're going to have to save that for another time. Um, if you like this video, please give us a thumbs up. Um, leave us a comment in the description. Um, subscribe. Absolutely. <laughs> subscribe. We want that. We do. <laughs> I mean, who wouldn't Follow that? us. <laughs> Mom, we're nerds. <laughs> um, we won't lead you off a cliff. You said follow us. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Alright, well until next time. Thanks for watching.